from the Crafty Girls. Today we are making hot cocoa slime and coffee slime with real coffee and real hot cocoa. I love hot chocolate, so I'm gonna make hot chocolate slime. I love coffee, but mom won't let us have it, but she won't mind if we make slime with it. Inspiration and a refreshing cup. It's nice and warm, even though it is kind of warm here for hot chocolate, doesn't mean you can't drink it. If you need to our channel, I'm Annalise. And I'm Julia. We're twins and we're eight. And we have an older sister, Rachel, and she's 11. And she's in other videos. If you like what you see here, please hit that subscribe button and click the thumb. Up. Now on to the video. Now these slimes are not edible, but they do smell like the real thing, which makes it extra fun. And some of you guys have requested poop slime, and this kind of doubles as poop slime, so it just smells good. Yeah, does it smell like cute? For this craft, you will need white PVA glue, saline solution, baking soda, instant coffee for the coffee slime, and hot cocoa mix for the hot cocoa slime. Let's get started. First thing we're gonna do is dump our white glue into a bowl. We're using about a cup. We're starting with our coffee slime. Add one teaspoon of baking soda and stir well. Now we're adding about a tablespoon of instant coffee granules. You can add as much as you want to get the color that you want. We're adding a little more. The more coffee you add, the better the smell. This looks about right. Add your saline solution in small amounts, stirring in between. Make sure you see boric acid or sodium borate in the ingredients. Or the words buffered solution somewhere on the bottle. Keep doing this until you see it pull away from the bowl. When it pulls away from the bowl, you can start working it with your hands. I like to put a little saline on my hand before I pick up the slime. It will be sticky at first, but as you knead it, the slime will get better. Try not to add more saline now as you don't want a stiff slime. Just listen to this. Now for the hot chocolate slime. We're going to do all the same steps. One teaspoon of baking soda. We're adding one packet of hot cocoa mix. Stir well. Now we'll add our saline. This is a nice slime. Here's our coffee slime. We're gonna put this into our Starbucks cup. You could put it in any cup, but we just thought it would be cute. For some reason, it is so satisfying. Here is my hot chocolate slime. It also looks and smells like chocolate pudding. We also whipped up a little bit of this plain white fluffy slime to act as whipped cream. Add a straw. So cute. It's good. Does it taste too bad? Better than baked bean slime. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was a funny story. If you guys haven't seen our America versus Australian secret ingredient slime challenge, we'll leave the link to it down below. Now we can even add sprinkles. I'm gonna add some blue ones. So pretty. How cute are these? These really smell so good. If you wanted to trick a friend, this would do it. P.S. Don't let them eat it. The job feels so cool with all of the sprinkles. 
look at this. Oh, my goodness. It looks like coffee with milk that's just like dissolving. It looks like a flower kind of. Bye beautiful flower. I have to say goodbye. Okay, gotta pull the whole thing out. out. My turn. Also guys, if you put it in a cup and push, it makes hilarious noise. Then up and push. This is Flarp Coffee Slurp. Oh. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please click the thumbs up and share with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe. I'm Annalise. And I'm Julia. Thanks for watching, you guys. We love you. Bye.